My name is Joe Leone. I'm the owner, operator, chef, baker, dishwasher, whatever it takes here at Joe Leone's in Point Pleasant Beach in the Seager. It's really, really important that uh, I keep it going and, and I want this heart to keep beating, enjoying the success and the fruits that it's giving not only to me but to my team members. When I turned 42 years old, I really started uh, getting a lot of anxiety, a lot of um, constantly getting very anxious and, and worried that something was going to happen to me in that year. Six people in my family had, had also um, died suddenly at 42 and I had that number in the back of my mind all through my 20s into my 30s and I hit 42 on my 42nd birthday and I really started, I really wanted to get interested and really start what's going on and, 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 and really get in there and see. Once I started really getting into my 40s, I really tried to do my best by losing weight uh, and watching what I ate, uh, getting more active with uh, activity of working out. Um, I noticed that I was struggling um, during the workout periods, um, not having a lot of energy. February of 2018, I had an episode that was, I guess, preparing me for something massive. I, I had a a sensation in my chest that was uh, really hard, like a hard pressing on my chest. My left arm started feeling numb and also my jaw had some discomfort to it. I had a hard time uh, cooling down. I would um, feel a little bit of uh, swelling in my, in, my, in my legs. I was very concerned and I was rushed to the hospital. After I got to Jersey Shore, I was really, really concerned. Dr. Patel was putting me through some tests. They cardioverted me because I was back in AFib rhythm. He asked me if I could walk around the hallway. I got up, I walked around uh, Northwest Pavilion, um, and I was walking around and I felt very gassed and I was really feeling that pain again in my left arm. At that point, he decided to call Dr. LaMarche and they brought me in for a catheterization. Dr. LaMarche told me that I was blocked and that I needed a triple bypass surgery. I was more excited to address the issue knowing that I was going to live longer if, if the surgery was uh, going to be a success, which obviously it was. I had a great support system of nurses and doctors and my family around me, uh, and I just was on the road to recovery. One of the things that Dr. Seelove expressed to me, he says, you have to keep blood flowing through the heart. Now that this heart is, is doing really well and I, I'm committed to keeping the blood flowing through the heart, I've been doing my passion of boxing cardio training. I have great energy. I'm feeling good as a mid-age person. When you have such a cardiac uh, episode, you start feeling bad for yourself. You start getting a little bit of depression. You start, you start worrying about something happening. But I look back at my life from when I opened up my business 21 years ago to, to now, I feel how really blessed I am and fortunate I am to, to live the American dream.